Sometimes there are equations or circumstances where you actually have things that vary in more than one element. So an example of that is in joint variation where we actually have a direct variation with two variables. The example we have here is distance is equal to rate times time. Pretty straightforward formula. If you think about it, if your rate increases, your distance would increase. Or if your time increases, your distance increases. So actually, distance is dependent on both rate and time, and there's a direct correlation between all three of those. We still have our constant of variation, that k that we, have, we typically throw in these problems, but in this case, it's actually a 1, so we don't actually need to put it in there. Okay? The other kind of variation where we actually can de depend on more than one thing is what we call combined variation, where we can have direct and inverse variation in the same equation. So this one right here isn't an applied formula, like the distance equals rate times time, but it is a formula in which the variable y varies directly with x, but also inversely with z. So what we have is a combined variation where we include both direct and inverse variation.